Hello YouTube, this is Christonian here playing Spaz, Space Pirates and Zombies. Uh, last, last time we uh, left off, we were just fighting up and we got a new recruit. Um, crap, I forget what I was going to say. Uh, I am going to go with someone to you two that commented on what camera kind of thing we want to do and when we're in battle we're gonna zoom out and when we're doing fine stuff like uh, shooting up asteroids and stuff like that we'll use this like zoom down sound good sound not uh, feel free to comment again see which way you guys want to have it uh, yeah that's what I forgot to say is uh, I forget that every time that we end the episode that we do have to come back to our mothership and I always seem to forget that but that's why we're always starting off right beside our big big uh, mothership so let's go system menu and we're just gonna look at missions go right into killing stuff one jump left for UTA patrol three jumps left for a crossing guard <laughs> asteroid clustered Beacon Basher, three jumps. Oh, those ones aren't too bad. Three jumps. Experiment Site, Beacon Basher. Just seems to be in out of nowhere. I don't think it's around a planet. Okay, so what I do is once I get in, I press spacebar, can zoom out, and both of the beacons are by themselves. So, uh,. And we might blow that up. I don't know if we have that. We might already have it, so it might not even be worth uh, going after the information. Boomerang? Yeah. So we already have it. So it's not a big deal. What the heck is. Function is currently offline. Huh. They're like black and blocking it out or something. Warp online. Offline. Under. Fixing I'm just gonna focus on uh, destroying everything. What the heck is happening? Oh, maybe these are the good ones. Oh, I went into a mission that was uh, for uh, our guys, because we're UTA this time. Another guy uh, commented, I don't have his username, um, but he was saying that uh, we should just go with whoever's in favor in whatever uh, system we go into. So if... Uh, the UTA like us in one system, we'll go with the UTA, and then if it's civilians, then we'll just go back and forth that way. So let's go for this crossing guard one. And hopefully I picked the right one. So. Guess I should have checked. Crossing guard. Okay. Escort to its cargo. Okay, so this is just one of those ones I stay close to the big ship and protect it. Which I'm doing a terrible job at. So 
So we just have to pay attention to oh, enemies coming on the screen and stuff like that. So level up, so let's pause it for a second, do a research. Pretty sure we upgraded everything that we wanted last time. We needed engines to upgrade. Achievement unlock chemistry set. Hmm. Okay. We haven't even done subsystems. So we'll just do subsystems level 1. And we'll keep it. No, it says level 12. So it's going to be far away. Uh, we'll just keep our points. Unless someone knows what to spend it on. And, uh,. We'll, uh... We'll keep the experience for, uh, bigger level ups at, like, level 12 or whatever. For the big bombs. Try to use those, even though they're supposed to be uh, pretty out of control sometimes. Gotta get used to these controls again. I gotta hold down my left and tap my right to let out my missiles. pretty easily, so we'll just keep it going. I am level 10, so maybe we should look at going through a barricade just for the hell of it. Going into another whole new area. Might as well keep pushing it. Tell me how much you want me to push instead of doing these until we get like really cool munitions or something like that. Cause I'll just push, push, push if you guys want to do that, and we'll uh, jump as many uh, barricades or whatever as we can. Maybe because I have new engines and stuff though too. That the uh, other guy can't keep up with kind of thing. I just don't want to get too far away, that's my biggest fear. At least we're getting a mission done. Way out there. Yeah, after this, we'll definitely go for a uh, barricade and uh, demolish it. Am I the only girl in this system? Wonder if I pick up. Wonder if he has to. At least there's no more enemies. 
Of course, I'll say that, and I'll come. Come on. Well, I blow up a barricade. Get some new ships. I hope I don't have to bring them all the way back to the beacon. That would be such a long thing. Oh, there's the escort health. I was wondering where I could uh, get that. Is he coming or is he sitting there? There's no way to see. I'm just going to go and see if he's coming. Because that would piss me off if I'm just too far away, like too far ahead, and he's just sitting there in the water, you know? Stupid crap like that. Because there are, especially escort missions, there's stuff like that that happens. Come on. Like he's sitting on the water. <sighs> so it doesn't look like I can go that far ahead of him before he shuts his engines off. That's about as far as I can go. Go back up a little bit, get him going again. Sorry guys, I had you guys waiting. But a freaking escort. Look how slow he's going. I don't know why he needs escort. He's a pretty good ship. He's as good as me. Just sputtering along super slow. As long as I don't have to bring him back to the beacon, I won't have to strangle him. Blow him up. Good, good, good. Okay. So, this is Christonian here playing Spaz. I'm just going to call it an episode, and next episode, we're going to smash through the next barrier. So, see you guys soon. This is Christonian, signing off. Bye.